We leave you tonight with a big push to save one of the smallest and most vulnerable creatures in Canada. It is the burrowing owl, once abundant in the West, now disappearing at an alarming rate. So the Calgary Zoo has launched an innovative campaign to give them a better chance to survive. CTV's Alberta Bureau Chief Janet Dirks has the details. They stand perfectly still, blending into the background. Yet these burrowing owls are on the alert. 15 of them temporarily living at the Calgary Zoo. This species is Canada's fastest declining bird of prey. Once they used to be found across the native prairie that we would have in BC, Alberta, Saskatchewan, even into Manitoba, but that's no longer the case. Lack of habitat, a shortage of food, pesticides reduce the burrowing owl to fewer than 800 pair in the country. This is an endangered species. There's eight females and seven males. The Calgary Zoo captured these owls in southern Alberta, the smallest ones with little chance of surviving in the wild at this stage will remain here over the winter. We take care of them, we keep them until uh, next spring, then we actually release them as pairs. By staying here in their first year, when they would normally have flown to the U.S. or Mexico, the zoo says their survival rate increases, and that means they have a greater chance of producing more little owls. Actually, when owls embark on migration in their second year compared to their first, their chance of making it back to Canada goes up from 6% to 40%. Protecting these raptors is something the conservation director feels strongly about. I love burrowing owls for so many reasons. Um, they're an iconic part of our Canadian heritage. They're just a small owl that is just trying to make a living of its own, that's trying to, you know, exist. And it's something that we should cherish because they're a precious part of our native prairie. Before the owls are released, they'll be fitted with tiny transmitters so their movements can be tracked and their survival studied. If the results are good, the zoo hopes to expand the program. Janet Dirks, CTV News, Calgary.